The thing about consistency is that it makes people sit up and notice how serious you are in what you say and what you do. Like my videos, for example, one of the frequent feedbacks that I get from people, my viewers, is that I am consistent in publishing my videos every week. And believe me, that gives me a leverage when I'm talking to them. A lot of us get really excited and motivated when we start something new, but that motivation goes away slowly as time passes. How can we keep this same enthusiasm alive all through? So in this video, I'm going to be sharing with you a few secrets to achieve consistency in whatever you do. Let's get started. Hey there, my name is Aparna. I am a certified coach. Every week I bring to you tips, tricks, tools and hacks that can help you upskill your life. And if this interests you, do consider subscribing to my channel. And while you're there, do not forget to press a bell icon so you're notified every week when I post a new video. Consistency is a key to productivity. If there's one thing that separates the greatest, the most successful leaders from the rest of the crowd, it is that they stay consistent in what they say and what they do. And my endeavor has always been to go that path. My favorite Dwayne Johnson has said, success isn't always about greatness. It's about consistency. Consistent hard work leads to success. Greatness will come. So how can you stay consistent in what you choose to do? Here are my secrets. The first one is to take small steps. If you want success in life, you must work at it every single day. Similarly, to create consistency in your life, you must aim for daily progress because you cannot change things overnight, can we? Great things are always started small and there's so many stories out there that prove this theory. And that's the approach you need to take for your goal as well. Do something every single day. For example, for my video creation, since I've taken an example of videos to prove my consistency, for video creation, there is a process that I have set up for myself. First, I start to think about the themes and ideas. Then I figure out the topics that I need to talk about within that theme. Then I finalize what is it that I'll talk about in each of these topics, something that people have not spoken already. So there's a bit of research involved here. After that comes scripting, then shooting, editing and upload. Doing this all at once can get a little bit overwhelming, but it's not like I've not done it before. But there's a danger that you will start losing interest when you create a pressure situation around for yourself. So starting small and creating tasks into bite-sized pieces will help you to digest them properly. Then it's easier for you to stay consistent. My second secret is to feed your motivation. In Star Wars, Yoda said, Try not. Do or do not. There is no try. This applies equally to motivation as well. If you want to get motivated but are unable to, then you're not fully committed to that idea. If you decide to get motivated, then things will begin to happen. Feeling your motivation means that you create an environment around you that, that gives you a constant supply of motivation to you. For me, quotes, sayings, phrases, vision boards, images, videos, and even my goals printed in bold serve as motivation. And I constantly have them all around me. The more you feed your motivation, the more consistent your performance will be. Think about it. The third secret is to massage your mindset. What do I mean by that? Everything that happens in our life, everything, is a product of our mind. Whatever you think you'll achieve, you'll definitely achieve it. If you think you cannot do it, you definitely won't do it. I speak to myself every morning. The set of phrases that I remind myself, chant even so that I can get it into my thick skull. Think of your mind as a tool that can be enhanced. So train it by using positive self-talk. You can also use affirmations to train your brain. And I've already spoken about this. I will leave the link to that video in the description below. Fourth secret is to create deliberate habits. Most of our consistent behaviors are due to the habits that we keep. What we do daily will give us the result that we want. If your goal is to get good health, then you must have healthy habits to get to it. That's one of the best lessons I've learned in my life. If I want to be consistent in anything, say working out or practicing meditation, I must first do it enough number of times that it becomes a habit. 
After that, it becomes a lifestyle. So I have to deliberately create space for it until it becomes my routine. Then I don't have to focus on it anymore. The behavior is set within me. If you understand the power of this, then you can basically do whatever you want in your life. Coming back to my secrets to stay consistent, the last one I have for you is learning to chill. To stay consistent in what you want, you must first cut yourself off from all the negativity that is surrounding you. You must learn to let go. Let go of everything that is blocking you from your goal. This is probably one of my greatest secrets. I don't take things personally until it's a deliberate personal attack. Also, what is the point in holding on to things that don't serve you? It's better to let go and create space for things that really matter to me. That way, I will be able to be more productive. And of course, with it comes consistency. Well, those are my five secrets that I follow to stay consistent in whatever I do. And if you have any other point to add to this, let's discuss. Drop me a note in the comment section below or you may reach out to me in any of the social media platforms that I'm in. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, if you find it resourceful, do hit a like button and share it with your friends. I'll see you next week with another video. Until then, take good care of yourself. Bye-bye.